Welcome, adventurer! Probably you already know that your companion Carlock need an infernal iron to repair a hellish engine inside her chest. So, today I'm gonna show you all location where you can find infernal iron and even infernal alloy that will allow you to craft a very powerful and unique armor. And we will start with a blighted village. The building we are looking for will be just in front of fast travel location. I mean this building. And if you don't know how to open this door, the key will be over here. You see, just lying on a crate. Let's pick it up. And let's enter. It feels like it's some kind of abandoned forge. But still we need an iron. Let's go inside and climb this ladder. Oh dear. Hell yeah, Someone's traps trap. everywhere. But what we need will be this chest. Let's crank it up. Excellent. But what inside? You know what? Take it by yourself. Come on, you need it. Well, 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 infernal iron, some blacksmith's note, and a sword. Pretty good sword, one-handed sword, of course, if you like them. Collecting this infernal iron is not an easy task at all. But I bet you remember this place. We are in a goblin camp and this is Dorexley. Take a key from him and then let's go and open Path his treasury. Be Behind his throne room. Oh, that treasure is just a huge one. But what most important, there will be a infernal iron. Let's take it. Yes. Can use this to fix me. Oh, she's happy. In the Underdark Grimforge, there will be a very interesting character. You can find him not far away from the entrance, and his name is Keith. Let's go and talk to him. How peculiar. Smooth face, cobbled edges. They're a sign. They must be. A sun dweller in these parts. Look here, my topside friend. I need fresh eyes, and I doubt I'll find fresher. Hmm, a fairly welcome, rarely in the As rare as a smile in Shindlerin, you might say. But I've no skill for slaving. I prefer chisel to cane. But these learned eyes reach their limits, and so I must humbly request yours. He will ask us to examine the statue and say our opinion. The rubble, all of it, if I may be so bold. Take a look. Tell me what you see. And be thorough. And yeah, you will have to pass all of those checks, all three of them. And when you pass those checks, let's report. Incredible. An entire history risen from dirt and debris. Picture it. An ancient city, hewn from the stone by disciples of Shah, later abandoned. Untold centuries later, a new tribe revives it. Fresh walls, fresh sculptures, until a great hell beast charges through, toppling the walls and crushing the people. Now we know the story of the Grim Force. That explains the infernal play I found. Oh, really? Perhaps you might have use of it. And here we go, friends. But my work has only begun. There is more still to find. I must get to it. Okay, you're say enough. You can trade with him, but... Yeah, we got Infernal Iron? No! Infernal Aloy! And you know what it means? It means when you meet a blacksmith in the inn next time, he will be able to forge yourself a very unique and legendary armor. Oh, that's something special. Let's take a look.
Yeah, Infernal Alloy. And in the blink of an eye, we appear here in the Jantarum hideout. Yeah, I will not show you the whole way, but you must go over here to secret walls. And you see, this is a way to Underdark. There will be a few wolfies protecting this hideout. Not a huge threat after all. But let's go inside, and what do we have here? In the right chest. Whoa, infernal iron? I'll trade that. The next piece of infernal iron we will find in Mason's Guild. Yeah, yeah, that fellow that secretly rules the world. But probably in Faerun something went wrong. For this building is completely abandoned years and years ago. But nevertheless, over here, my friends, just lying on the table. Yeah, infernal iron. Let's collect it. The next one will be very weird, and we can get it in Gauntlet of Shar from the devil named Jorger when you defeat him. And he will be a very powerful opponent. But it can be done. Let's search his body. And guess what? It will be infernal metal. So, not infernal alloy, not infernal iron, but infernal metal. I don't know what to do with it, friends. And if you find where can you use infernal metal, please let me know in the comment section below. It looks the same, but the name is completely different. Hmm, that's a mystery, and maybe you will manage to solve it. And the last piece of infernal iron we will get in the same location, but from the other side. There will be a treasure room very near to Balthazar. So be careful, my friends. And this door will be very difficult to unlock. It will require you to pass a check. 30 difficulty will be 30, just imagine it. But it can be done, so let's go. I already unlock it and open it. And one of those chests, probably this one, yes, will contain the last piece of infernal iron you can get. So let's take it. Now we collect them all. And the last thing I want to tell you about will be this mask. You can get 3 or 4 in the Grimforge. They just lying all around. In the act 2, when you meet a blacksmith and talk to Nowhere him, safe from this he can absolute. actually forge something, something good sharp, from them. A few things left. Okay. You mention about materials. What do you mean? Smell it almost. Somewhere in the area. Underground, maybe. Out there in the shadows. If you find it, bring it to me. I'll make something incredible. Oh, really? I found some hellish mess, can you? Make something. Using something that's already fabricated is tough. But I can try. How many do you have? Well, only one so far. But you can find more. Hmm. I thought I sniffed American scent somewhere. These must have been a pain to get a hold of. American masks are brittle, so what I make won't last as long as my usual pieces. And here we go. There. Be careful who sees you using that might draw the wrong sort of eyes. And we got an excellent and exclusive bomb. Friends, I hope you enjoy my video and if you do, don't forget to like it and subscribe to see more interesting adventures in the world of Faerun. And friends, if you have something to add, feel free to leave me a comment. It will be interesting to me and to my subscribers. With that said, thank you all for watching, and I will see you in my next one. Meet you there!